Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today in this video, we're going to fix Valorant's most frustrating error, the internet not found. You may have seen many other videos where you will be able to change the IP address, going to TCP IP protocols and changing it to 8888-8444, whatever it is. I'm not going to do those things. It's a simple and quick fix. It has, it is a bug with the Valorant. I'm not sure why they're not fixing this yet. This is not your ISB problem. This is not your computer problem, but it is Valorant itself. And we're gonna fix this in a quick one minute action. So what you're going to do, since I already had this error, I had to experiment a lot. So I spent about one hour for this and I've lost a game. I was AFK, people would be mad at me, they would have reported me and Valorant also warns me that you're offline, that you're AFK and I'm gonna ban you. But also it is not my problem. So what we're going to do, we're going to go for um, red games in the C folder. So you should be deleting this. Plus shift plus delete and click yes. So that will delete your entire Riot game folder. You might see that Riot logo appears whenever you open it, but then it just stuck and says no internet found. So for that, you just, you just delete it and just go for the program data. And here in the program data, you might find another Riot games. And if you don't see this program data, you might have to enable the hidden files so i can as you see i have enabled the hidden items this is windows 11 similarly it is available in windows 10 and 7 you can just go to view options and you can get it enabled and right now we can we have enabled the hidden folders go into program data delete the real games from there and also with the users go there and your username go for the app data go for the local and here you will see again something with the real games so just delete it and delete the Valorant again. Now you'll be able to reinstall as well. And one more experiment that you can try. This is so weird that you won't you won't believe it. You won't be even be able to install, reinstall Valorant if you're getting that no internet found error. Even though if you go to website of the Valorant, it will not let you sign in. It will not let you sign up. They you won't be able to download the extension file either. Although if you even have a .exe file, you still wouldn't be able to download it because that's a server error. There's something that, that technically they have uh, in, in, installed something in. So that is not letting you to download or install the Valorant application again. So what you need to do, you just have to delete everything, whatever the app data and everything. Don't try the bullshit settings, whichever, whoever asks you to change the IP address and stuff because that, that thing doesn't work. And you know, I was frustrated a lot and this helped me fix it. So I've deleted everything and I've reinstalled the game. It took me about 10 minutes since I got a 150 Mbps connection. Oh, I hope you, I'm expecting that you have this sometimes some kind of similar internet speed so that this is a frustration free experience. You just have to reinstall the Valorant and that only works with this technique. And I hope this worked for you. And when you open the Valorant, that thing should work. There should not be a problem. If there is, I'm going to retire from this game. That's all for it today. And if you're happy with this content, please do like and subscribe. And I'll be there to reply to your comments if you do have any doubts. Thanks for watching the video. Have a great day. Peace out. Ah, yeah. This is an introduction. Oi, my